everybody. Um, so I am here at home and I thought that because, I guess because I haven't really introduced myself, um, that I would do that. So, but I was tired of my bathroom, so I was like, okay, change of, change of scenery. Um, before I even start talking about myself, I want to show you where I live because I live on this ranch um, in Texas. And this, to me, is paradise. Like, some people say, oh, paradise is like, for me, Hawaii or, you know, somewhere like that. This is my home so let me show you and before I show you excuse all of my children's toys in the yard so please excuse that so there is my neighbor's yard normally they have cows um, I guess they went in and this is my backyard by the way this is my patio so this is what I see when I come out here and then this my children's swing set and then this back here that building right there is my shed on the bottom and our apartment on top so this right here is we live on half an acre so this is our property minus the front yard okay so yeah and Texas is super windy, so let me go back inside. Okay. So, um, yeah, I'm going to sit down now. Texas is super windy, so I apologize if you can't really hear me. Hi, baby. So, my name is Gabriella. Um, I was born in Texas, raised in Texas, you know, and I live here still. Um... I have three children. I have a five-year-old, a two-year-old. My two-year-old, she will be three next month in May. And then I have, today he's two months old, so that's my youngest. Um, so I just gave birth. Um, yeah, so I think what I like the most about my town is that it's a really good place for me to raise my children. Before we lived here, we lived in Austin, in North Austin. Um, it was so bad, the area that we lived in. And I was always scared that something would happen to my children. Like, the area that I lived in, we would just go to the mailbox. Just walking to the mailbox in the apartment complex, and there would be people fighting. There would be gunshots. Um all kinds of stuff it was just horrible and here my son he goes to this amazing school um basically the only thing that i have to worry about here is rattlesnakes which is bad right but i mean there's stuff that they sell you know to get rid of rattlesnakes so anyway um so yeah um i am married um my husband's name is jorge and he's from honduras and he he um We've been together next month. It'll be four years. So, yeah, my oldest son is not his. But my younger two are his. And we just got married February 5th. So, I had been wanting it for a while. But it just didn't happen. <laughs> yeah, mama, you're just silly. So, it just didn't happen. But I'm so thankful that it did. I... We got married on the 5th, and shh, we got married on the 5th, and six days later on the 11th, I had my my youngest son. I think February was like the best, best month for me, because during my pregnancy with him, it was just, it was just rough, because for, I think the first trimester and part of the second trimester, I was high risk. And there was a time where I had to be, um, where I had to be on bed rest. So, it was just hard for me. Then his birth was traumatizing. I came out of that, so, that whole experience, um, my third C-section. But this time was different. I went in and I knew that something wasn't right. And so 
so I was kind of like close to dying but thankfully I came out of the situation or I came out you know I came out of it and I had depression before really bad and I think that almost being that close to dying really changes your view on things and it make it just made me so thankful for everything that I have and believe it or not my depression is has gone away so I it's like no longer I feel I feel like I'm normal again so yeah um, anyway about me my hobbies I used to like to sew I mean I still do but I don't have that much time to do it um, I love makeup I love <laughs> I love doing my makeup <laughs> anybody's makeup actually um, I have a small collection I guess compared to other people but I love everything about makeup. Um, I also like... What else do I like? I like writing people. I like to, to write my pen pals. I have like six pen pals right now. Yeah, baby. So, I have six pen pals and I think like three or four are from a different country. No, yeah, like three are from a different country. So, I like to do that. I like to go shopping. Um... I'm from Corpus Christi and I love the beach. I used to go there with my son. He was like eight, nine months old. And I would go every single day. Or maybe like five days out of the week. We would go and we would... I would pack my cooler with juice and water and snacks and all kinds of stuff. And him and I, we would go there all day. And it was just so nice. So nice. Um, yeah, so, what else? I don't know. My hair is all up everywhere because it's windy. Um, what else? I don't know what else. What else do I like? <laughs> um, oh, couponing. Ho hello. I love to coupon. Um, I like to get stuff free. <laughs> I like to get stuff cheap, if not free. So, that is, like, another hobby of mine. Um... Yeah, I think mainly, like, I'm a stay-at-home mom, so I think mainly I just, I just focus on my kids, focus on my house. My house is really messy right now, but I just focus on that stuff. Um, family is really important to me, so I think my, my kids are just everything to me, so. Yeah, so that's basically it, I guess. Um, if you have any questions, I'll do another video. <laughs> I don't even know. What, baby? I see you. Um, so, yeah. Uh, okay. So, I think that that's it. If you want to know anything else, like I said, just let me know. I hope you can hear this because it's so windy. But that's Texas for you. So, alright. Uh, like my video, comment, and I'll have another video up soon. Thank you.